Good afternoon. I hope everybody out there is having a great day, a great um, evening, or a great morning for that matter, wherever you are in the world. And at this time, I want to talk a little bit about failure. Now, as you know, the economy is something that is running uh, at a rate that seems to be um, maintaining uh, a way of, of functioning that is um, har harming, uh, making it more challenging, uh, more difficult for a lot of people to really live a, a decent quality of life. And as the economy continues to go this way, we're starting to see failure happen at a very high rate. But the one thing that is important to note about failure is that we need it. Trust me, every single person on this earth is going to fail. They're going to embarrass themselves. They're going to make mistakes. They're going to question themselves when they fail. The only people who don't fail are dead people. So if you're alive, you're going to fail. Just like how we know death is imminent and it's going to come to us, failure is going to happen to us as well. It's the same thing. It's going to happen. But it's what we do and what solutions we use that determines the difference between a person who fails as a victor or a person who fails as a victim. And when you look at failure, failure has a unique structure to it because it draws us out to challenge ourselves to see if we are willing enough to have the courage and the faith to actually go out and learn from failure, make adjustments, and try again. Realistically, failure is something that is a, a great asset to have in life because it keeps you hungry. It keeps you moving. It gives you the fuel you'll need to keep on pushing on. That's if you decide to have a mindset of a person who wants to be resilient, to be determined, who has hard, who represents hard work, determination, ambition, and drive to go beyond the reality of themselves and to push themselves to be great. Now, anybody in this world or everybody in this world is going to go through failure. And the truth is, is that as we see the economy go the way how it's going and society's principles and values tend to, to, to break down and change, as we see that happening, we are going to see failure happening even more at an alarming rate. And it's going to increase. Now, we can have a percentage of people that who end up failing, that become a victim, will actually turn to things to harm them to deal with failure or we have those that are the small percentage that decide to make something happen with failure and no matter what happens you have to embrace it because it's coming or it's happening or it has happened and it will happen again so take this time to understand what failure means to you Take this time to understand what you can do about it. What are some of your own solutions to help you with failure? And make a decision. When failure happens in your life, do you want to be a victim or a victor? Because the choice is ultimately yours and your results in life will be a reflection of the choices that you make. Take this time to understand failure. Have a great day.